How's that? They always announced you as a 1994 Brazil Open winner. That was the BJJ uh, um, um, tournament that I went back to Brazil to compete. Who was in that tournament with you? Um, actually, was one. His son fights in um, in the UFC uh, nowadays. Um, I forgot his first name, but he's he's. I mean, he's back. You know, that's from way the same back. Generation. Yeah. Yeah. yeah, some of the things I really don't, I remember the fact, but uh -huh. I don't remember the names. You know, we're getting old. Hey, I'm the same, <laughs> brother. Man, that's kind of like why we're here. We're trying yes. to capture it with history. All right, you had mentioned Battle Cake as one of the two big events here in the United States. And you went to Canada, Quebec, actually, to fight in Battle Cake, where the entire card, everybody that was on that card got arrested. I was... You're 100% right. I yeah. was <laughs> defending my title yes. against Carl Franks. Carl oh, Franks was wow. a six times uh, kickboxer. Kick, he's a very good stand up. Uh, I mean, he finished he him on his was, feet. He was, yeah. yes. I saw um, that one, yeah. Yeah. Uh, The plan was because my background back then was a BJJ, so everybody think then, you know, uh, or everybody thought then, okay, start the fight, throw a punch, takedowns, BJJ. <laughs> I, I told Carson, I said, listen, I'm going to do something different. I, I'm really going to go, I'm going to make him think that I'm going to go for the takedown and I'm going to come back strong with the hands. And uh, my, my hands wasn't that good, but, you know, have weights, they throw punches. <laughs> <laughs> That's what I can. <laughs> <this one. laughs> yeah, exactly. So I think then um, um, that's exactly what happened. I won the fight in one minute and 15 seconds. Jeez. I was extremely happy I about bet. that. To the time I went back to the hotel. Okay, so when did you know that there was going to be problems with the law? We didn't know because... Even in I, the airport? No. The thing is, the law just can't arrest you after you commit the crime. That wasn't a crime. It was a political mm. controversy, a political, you know, uh, whatever it was then the Egypt reservations allow us to fight. So... Actually, the police was watching physically in the place to make sure that we will fight because the engine was they 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 sold to the promoters saying that don't worry about it. There's a range of reservations we have on law. You can come over here and fight, and it'll be no problem. And that was not true. That it was you know it's part of a Canada, it's part of a Quebec Quebec law, whatever it was. So. Long story short, I won the fight. I'm so happy. I'm ready to celebrate with my friends. Took a shower <laughs> quick. I have like 20 people with me. Let's go have some dinner and some drinks. Yeah, exactly. And um, I see about a 30 police officers walking into the hotel. And I'm thinking, because I saw all the cars outside, I'm like, man, somebody's got somebody's a problem. Somebody's in trouble. Somebody <laughs> has a problem, a big problem. Yeah. <laughs> so the guy then was leading the police officers, the group went to the front desk and um, I mean it was a 30 seconds talk and he comes in my direction with um, uh, the Russian midway picture, um, I forgot his name. Okay. By the way, you guys know that guy. Okay. And when you, I, I mean, Not of me. course I say no. Of no course that, uh, Never heard know. of him. It's a but Brazil I mean, street cred but coming I, through. But you yeah. know when something's not right, yeah. you know, and my gut's like, oh, my God, why did he want So he goes back to the, the, the front desk, and he comes back in less than a second. He say, you don't know Igor Zanovia, yeah. but you know Conan, right? And I look at no. my picture on his end, and it's saying... You say double no. I say, I guess... <laughs> for twin, sure no. My twin brother, he just left. I guess no. I do. <laughs> and I mean, I could not say yeah. that. <laughs> and he's like, oh, um, I, I'm so sorry. But exactly like that. He was sorry to arrest and say, I got to arrest you. And I say, I didn't do anything. He say, you did. In legal prize fighting. I'm like, what kind of a charge is that? He's we, less we than you got invited. a ticket. It was a very low, you know, money to get paid. It's really I mean, not a prize. You, you, don't you, know? get a, you don't get a rest. <laughs> I still have more to get here than I did win. <laughs> and say, yeah, but uh, you got to understand, it's a political thing. Yeah. Okay. So I got to take you in. And the good thing, I guess, was because the other fighters, some of the guys then were there, heard then what happened. And they they away, took yeah, off. They, yes. So pretty much, you know, as soon as uh, I was finished with the fight, I ended up putting him in jail with... Um, with some other uh, 10 guys, the, the referee. Uh, John, the referee too? Everybody, they found some of the guys and um, 
But yeah. the, the thing was, they just want to make sure that we go through the exposure, you know, to show oh, they, the it was public. A show. Yeah, we it was a show. People. The funniest thing that happens in that time in jail, I guess that was funny. They put him in the cell by myself because heavyweight MMA fighter. I don't think nobody wants to stay there, and especially when I'm in a bad mood. Yeah. Well, hopefully they let you keep your title. Too. Yeah. You know, yeah. So you can. No, they, they, they allowed me to. Yeah, yeah. They allowed me to. That's funny. But they that's funny. Thing, I remember, like three o'clock in the morning, I guess uh, a guy, drunk guy, walks in. I think they didn't have any bad space. Uh, I was searching the bad mood, and I say, "You better put him in another place. Yeah. Don't put him away. No, yeah. Because yeah. he's not going to be good." And I and all the 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 CEOs, I guess. They kind of say, oh, don't worry about it. We're going to find him a place. He's just drunk. But uh, uh, it wasn't just a bad taste. And the next day, I mean, no next day, that was a Friday. I stayed for 40 hours on a Monday morning. They made sure, but that was something they, they really um, set up for us to leave the jail with the cameras outside. Oh, yeah. <sighs> going to the court. The with perp walk. 80% of the people in the court was the media with cameras yeah. and reporters. <sighs> Make sure that we have each one of us would stand up and say, Then I apologize to be fighting uh, in Canada, illegal prize fighting. You know, and I, I believe in, in, in Canada, I still hold the um, judge with, uh, with the wig. Yeah. The, 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 so the some of the guys were kind of want to laugh. I'm like, Man, if you laugh, I and they keep moving I here, yeah. I'm going to catch you. Yeah, yeah. <laughs> so um, but, uh, it was a good experience, and it was worth it.